po. Good evening po, bawat isa. Welcome po sa ating uh, online prayer work. Sa, this is Pastor Well Edio. And I'm with uh, Pastor Shikaina and Faith. Okay, samahan niyo po ako sa ating online prayer work sa inyo po. We will start in uh, a couple of minutes. Kamusta po kayo? Kamusta po ang bawat isa? Nananabig ba ang puso natin para sa pagkakas ng ating Diyos? Dahil kayo sa iba't ibang lugar, nagsakripisyo kayo, naniniwala ko, ang Diyos Hallelujah. ay hindi niya ang power na langit niya. Habang tayo po ay naghihintay ng ating yes. mga kapatid, sige po, makinig po tayo at awitan po natin si Lord. Ibigay po ang puso ng pagsamba sa kanya. Yes! Sabayan nyo kami. Actually, ang tunay na audience natin dito si Lord. We are all the performers here. Bakit? What we're singing here ay ang mga outfitting niya. It's not the song of Bishop Art. Hallelujah. Two minutes na lang po. So, ano yung kanta natin? Ano yung kong may... Welcome po. Good evening po. Hello po. Lucky and uh, Julia. Good evening po. Olivia is also watching with us and uh, si George Villa Corsa kumusta po kayo? Bigay po ang puso ng pagsamba sa kayo. Yes. Sabayan niyo kami. Actually, ang tunay na audience natin dito si Lord. We are all the performers here. Bakit? What we're singing we'll here ay ang mga outfit. Less than, 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 less than two, two minutes na lang po. Song of Bishop Art, but these are the songs of God for His own glory. Yes! Oh! 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 Welcome po sa ating uh, online prayer works. Good evening po. Good evening sa Mojica family. Thank you. 
faithfulness, His greatness. Amen po ba? Pilipinas, sila Yasmin, sila Sister Gagay, welcome po. At naka, nanonood din po sila Des, si Ate Ben, si Ron, at uh, si Marian Tenorio. Good evening po sa bawat isa. Welcome po sa ating online prayer works. At uh, patuloy po tayo na ito po yung the best time na tayo po ay manalangin lumapit sa Diyos. Amen po ba? Amen. Yun. Palakpak po sa Lord. Uh, let us pray. Uh, let us uh, bow our heads and close our eyes. Yes, Father God, we thank you. Muli, Lord, sa gabi po ito, sapagkat, Lord, kami po ay muli nakapag-broadcast. Muli, Lord, ay you have allowed us, Lord, to be used mightily sa gawain ito. Lord, in this time, uh, times, O oh God, ito po yung panahon na mas dapat kaming lumapit sa iyo, manalangin. Salamat po, Diyos, for giving us a chance, Lord, upang makalapit sa iyo ng malapit na malapit. It is not because of what we have done. It is because, Lord, of what your Son did for us. Dahil sa ginawa ng iyong anak na si Jesus, sa sakripisya niya, Lord, kami po ay nabiyayaan. It is by grace, Lord, 
grace, your mercy continues to overflow in our lives. Kaya kami po, Lord, ay patuloy at patuloy na nakakalapit sa iyo. We pray, Father God, na you would speak to us, Lord, and you would answer our prayers, Lord. Salamat po, oh Diyos. In Jesus' mighty name, Amen. Amen. Oh yeah. God is good po. Hindi po ba? And all the time, God is good. Yun, mga kapatid, um, uh, we live in the world right now that is full of uh, afflictions. Affliction means uh, pain and suffering. And there is no one who is uh, right now afflicted or affected by the harsh realities of life. Uh, marami po sa atin, um, apektado talaga. Lahat tayo affected by these uh, realities of life. And uh, sometimes we tend to ask this question, why do bad things happen happen to good people? You know, mahirap pong sagutin yan actually. But uh, we, we have to understand mga kapatid, God is sovereign. So all that is happening ay in a law. We have to understand them God allows some things in, in this life uh, for His purpose. Hmm. Yung, kung inyo pong matatandaan, ano, doon sa yung similar na sufferings like this, ay, it happened, no, doon sa buhay po ni Job. No? Job was a righteous man in Job chapter 1 verse 1 he is righteous sabi kung ganon yet he suffered in so many ways that are almost beyond belief yung titignan niyo pa ang hirap paniwalaan na um, y- yung mga sufferings na kanyang uh, pinagdaanan ano po but God allowed Satan to do everything he wanted to Job except to kill him ano po it was allowed by God and what was God's reaction during that time? Ang sabi po ni Job doon sa John 13 verse 15, Though he, though he slay me, yet will I hope in him. And the Lord gave and the Lord has taken away my, may the name of the Lord be praised. Yun din po yung nakasulat sa Job chapter 1 verse 21. Job did not understand why God had allowed the things he did. No? But he knew, he knew that God was good and therefore continue to trust in Him. Ultimately po mga kapatid, that should be our re- reaction as well. Dapat ganun din po ang ating reaction. Um, mahirap pong, uh, actually, if you're going to think about it, ang sa, sa, yung tanong na why do good, uh, bad things happen to good people, in all honesty po, sabi, ay, ano po, ito, ito, ito po isipin natin, mga kapatid. In the absolute sense of the word, there is no good people. Wala naman pong good people. In the absolute sense of the word po, ha? that's what I'm saying. No, all of us are tainted by, by sin. Di po ba? Kung inyo po matatanda, nakasulat po doon sa Ecclesiastes chapter... Um, 7 verse 20 ang sabi po doon indeed there is no one on earth who is righteous no one who does what is right and never sins nakasulat po yun Ecclesiastes chapter 7 verse 20 and if you are going to remember Romans 3.23 po diba all have seen and fall short of the glory of God yun po yung nakasulat and Jesus said no one is good except God alone Now, nakasulat din po sa Luke chapter 18 verse 19 all of us feel the effects of sin in one way or another. Sometimes, kasalanan po natin actually. The things that are happening to us are the products or yung ng ating mga wrong choices. Yung po ang katotohanan. And other people's choices. Oo, may mga maling ginawa yung iba so we suffer as well. You know, so, what we have to understand, mga kapatid, we live in a fallen world. This is a fallen world, mga kapatid. And we experience the effects of the fall. 
ito po yung katibayan talaga na this is a fallen world and we need salvation. If we're not going to turn to Jesus who can save us, we will really fall. Yung po yung katotohanan. That's why we need Jesus Christ. When wondering why God would allow uh, bad things to happen to good people, ito po, apat na, the, the, there are four things that we have to remember. Bad things may happen to good people in this world, but this world is not the end. Hindi po yung, hindi po ito yung ating end. Tandaan po natin, being Christians, iba po yung perspektibo po dapat natin. We have an eternal perspective. Kung inyo po matatandaan sa 2 Corinthians chapter 4, verse 16 to 18, ang sabi po doon, we do not lose heart, no? though outwardly we are wasting away, yet inwardly we are being renewed day by day. For our light and momentary troubles are achieving for us an eternal glory that far outweighs them all. So we fix our eyes not on what is seen, but on what is unseen. Since what is seen is temporary, but what is unseen is eternal. Ito pong lahat ng ito ay temporary lang. Itong lahat ng ating nakikita, what is seen is temporary. Ito pong nararamdaman natin, itong na-experience natin, this is, uh, these are all temporary. And we should look ahead, forward, doon po sa what is eternal. We fix our eyes on Jesus Christ. Kay Jesus lamang tayo tumingin, hindi yung sa sitwasyon natin, mga kapatid. Second thing that we have to remember when bad things happen is that God uses those things for an ultimate lasting good. Di po ba ang lagi po, lagi po nyo itong naririnig? Romans 8.28 All things work together for good to those who love God, those who are called according to His purpose. Hindi po ba? Si, kung inyo po matatanda, matatandaan si Joseph, Joseph the Dreamer, no? Uh, he suffered a lot, no? Ang dami niyang pinagdaanan. Pero doon po sa Genesis chapter 50, verse 19 to 21, ang sabi po doon, But Joseph said to them, Don't be afraid. Am I in the place of God? Hindi po ba? You intended to harm me, but God intended it for good to accomplish what is now being done, the saving of many lives. So then, don't be afraid. I will provide for you and your children. And he had reassured them and spoke kindly to them. Yung po, di ba? At the end, at the end, yung purpose ng Lord is He meant really for good. Yung po ang tanda natin. Pangatlo, no, Don't, bad things happen to good people but those bad things equip believers for deeper ministry ayun sabi po niya doon sa uh, 2 Corinthians chapter 1 verse 3 to 5 praise be to the to Jesus the Lord the Father of compassion and the good of all, the God of all comfort who comforts us in all our troubles so that we can comfort those in any trouble with the comfort we ourselves receive from God. For just as we share abundantly in the sufferings of Christ, so also our comfort abounds through Christ. Ibig sabihin po nito, uh, kung tayo po ay naka-experience ng trouble, we can easily comfort other people as well. Kasi, na-experience mo eh, you know. Uh, it will be greater kung mas madali ka makapag-comfort ng ibang tao. Kung ikaw mismo, you have suffered the same. No? So, ang sabi po doon niya ay, so with that we can comfort those on, in any trouble with the comfort we ourselves receive from God. Mga kapatid, parang uh, yung halimbawa, magmahal, hindi ka, maroon, hindi ka makakapagmahal o you cannot love if you have not experienced love. Kung hindi ka nakapagmahal, paano ka magmamahal? Kung you, you have not loved at all. 
Diba? Kailangan ma-experience mo how can you give something you don't have? Yung po yung uh, gusto kong ipunto. Those with battle scars can better help those going through the battles. Diba? Mas madaling mong ma- mai comfort o may papaliwanag sa kanila yung nararamdaman nila. Bad things, ito po, pang-apat, bad things happen to good people and the worst things happen to the best person. Ito po yung tanda natin. Kung inyo pong ma-re-recall, ano, Jesus was the only truly righteous one, yet He suffered. No? More than we can imagine. More than we can imagine. Di ba? Tayo po ay sometimes actually we deserve it. Eh. Kasi it's the product of our choices. Product of our sins. But Jesus Christ, hindi niyo po matatandaan. He does not deserve what He has suffered. But He bear all our sins para sa atin. Ang po natin palagi yan. And yet, hindi po ba hindi di complain para sa ating po yung mga kapatid. Uh, ito po, lagi po nating tatanggahan na Rom- yung Romans chapter 5 verse 8. God, but God demonstrate His own love for us in this. While we were still sinners, Christ died for us. Hindi po ba kahit pulong tayo po ay makasalanan pa lamang. Christ died for us. He loves us first. He loves us dearly, mga kapatid. In spite the simple nature of men, the people of this world, God still loves us. Jesus loved us enough to die and to take the penalty for our sins. Tandaan po natin yun. And He's the God who heals. God is a loving God. God can heal us from any disease. Tandaan po natin. In Jeremiah chapter 30 verse 17, ang sabi po doon, But I will, store, I will restore you to health and heal your wounds, declares the Lord, because you are called an outcast, Zion, for whom no one cares. Mga kapatid, God can heal us. God can heal our land. God can heal all those who are suffering right now. He is close to the broken hearted. Mga kapatid, if you are suffering right now, God is with you. God is with you right now. Kakasakasaman mo ang Diyos ngayong gabi nito. At alam ko, kinukomfort ka niya. Kapatid, we just ask the Lord. Ask the Lord. Lumapit lang po tayo sa Kanya. And let us pray. Let us pray. Sabi ng Lord sa Kanyang salita, And this is the confidence that we have toward Him, that if we ask anything according to His will, He hears us. And if we know that He hears us in whatever we ask, we know that we have the request that we have asked of Him. 1 John chapter 5, verse 14, yun po yung nakasulat. We, have, we should have this confidence, mga kapatid. Let us approach God. Lapit po tayo. And we can only do that if you accept Jesus Christ. Accept Him now. Tanggapin mo sa Jesus ang puso, mga kapatid. Tanggapin mo siya bilang inyong tagapaglikas. Lumapit po tayo at mananamin. Yes, Father God. We admit, Father and Lord, na kami po ay makasalanan. We have done grievous things. Marumi po kami, Lord. Marumi ang aming mga kamay. 
Mahal mo yung aming isipan, mahal mo yung aming puso. Pero Lord, ang iyong anak na si Jesus, inubos niya kami, Lord, sa lahat ng aming mga kasalanan, He cleansed us, Lord. And He has given us the robe of His righteousness. Kaya kami, Lord, ay nakakalapit sa iyo, ang malapit na malapit. At kami po, Lord, ay dumadala. Lord, we pray, Father God, that you would intervene and stop the spread of this virus. Yes. We pray, Father God, in the name of Jesus, that you would receive Lord, this virus from this day on forward. Na, Lord, ay hintuin po po ito. Ang virus na ito sa pagkala at yung mga kapatid ko po, Lord, na nanonood ang buong member ng Jesus Diamond to One Church of the Body of Christ, Lord, will not suffer any anyone who is uh, suffering, even though, Lord, doon sa mga tao may nagsasuffer ngayon, Lord, I declare, Father God, your healing. You are the God that heal us, that heal us thee. Heal it. You are the God, our healer. Ikaw yung Lord. You are the same God who healed many people, Lord. And you are the same God who, who we worship today. Ikaw pa rin ang Diyos. Hindi ka nagbabago. Tapat ka pa rin Diyos. Dakila ka pa rin Diyos. Ikaw pa rin ang Diyos. Hari ng mga hari. King of kings in the Lord of lords. And we trust in you, Lord. We trust in you. We put our trust in you, Lord, in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. We pray, Father God, for those, for those who are sick right now, Lord. Hipuin mo po sila. Let your healing, healing flow in Jesus' mighty name. Pagalingin mo po sila, Lord. You are Jehovah Rapha. Right now, Lord, pagalingin mo po yung mga tao, Lord, na may sakit. Right now, God, I declare, Father God, by your stripes, we are healed. By your stripes, oh God, we are healed right now. Ano bang sintomas, Lord? Yes. Tinatanggal mo yes. sa pangalan yes. ng Panginoon yes. Jesus. Ano bang sakit, karamdaman, tinatanggal mo, pinapagaling mo sa pangalan ng Panginoon Jesus. Hallelujah. Heal us, oh God. Lord, that meets all these sufferings and uh, ano man yung pinagdadaanan, Lord, Ikaw, Lord, let there be perseverance, patience, O God, amidst, the, amidst these sufferings, O God, in Jesus' name. Iparamdam mo po sa bawat isang yung comfort, O God. Your comfort, your loving kindness, O God, your loving comfort, yung pagyakap mo, Lord. Pagyakap po. Hirapin mo po, Lord, ang bawat isa. Right now, Mother God, Ikaw lang, mga kailangan namin. Ikaw lang, Lord. Salamat po, Lord. Hirapin mo po ang bawat isa. O oh God, iparandam mo, Lord, sa amin. Pwede hindi mo kami po abayaan na hindi mo kami iiwan, Lord. And all these things that is happening to us, Lord. Ikaw, Lord, ay mapapapurihan. Patuloy ka namin sasambahin, O Diyos. Lord, we pray even, Lord, sa aming mga, sa mahal namin presidente, Lord, sa mga leaders, even the leaders of this country, O God that you would give them wisdom, O oh God. That you would give them strength, Lord, upang mapanunuan nila ng maayos ang bansa po namin, ang lugar na ito, Lord. Let your favor, Lord, touch the hearts of these leaders, O oh God. Touch the hearts of these leaders, O oh God, that they would truly serve their country, O oh God. 
the residents and even the citizens for in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Patuloy mo, Lord, na ilagay sa puso nila na that they will, they will have compassion, O God. They will have compassion sa mga tao, Lord. In Jesus' name, we pray, Father God, sa lahat ng health workers, sa frontliners, O God, pamula doon sa nagpapantay ng checkpoint, mga mga barangay tano, Lord. Protect them, O God, that your divine protection be upon them. Sa mga nurse, Lord, bigyan mo po sila ng antibody. Sa mga doktor, Lord, bigyan mo po sila ng antibody, Lord. Increase, Lord, your strength. Increase their, um, yung panilang capacity to endure ano mang virus, oh God, patasin mo po yung immune system po nila in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, Lord, increase their immune system that they would be able to bear all this um, virus, oh God, in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, huwag mo po silang hayaan na mahawa, Lord, in Jesus' name. Yung mga doktor, mga nurse, yung mga nag-aalaga ng may sakit, Lord, patuloy mo, Lord, na ingatan sila. Cover them, oh God, With the blood of Jesus, with the blood of Jesus, ganun din po ang panalangin namin, Lord, sa aming mga mahal sa buhay, Lord. Lord, mga pamit, pamilya namin, Lord, wherever they are, that you would uh, take care of them, you would, you would protect them as well, O oh God, in Jesus' name. Father God, I pray, Lord, Lord, then sa provisions mo. Lord, you have said, In your word, in Philippians 4.19, O oh God, my God shall supply all our needs according to your riches in glory, Lord. O oh my Lord, you are Jehovah Jireh. You are Jehovah Jireh. I declare, Father God, that you would supply, you would provide. Lord, ano mga pangangailangan ng mga kapatid ko, saan man sila naroon. O oh Lord, may kagamitin kang tao upang i-provide ng pangailangan, lahat ng pangailangan, Lord, pagkain, Lord, even yung pambayad ng rent na sa bahay, Lord, you would touch the hearts of the landlords and owners of uh, our flat, oh God, that they would reconsider, that they will have compassion, that they will wave off, Lord, that they will wave yung yung bayad sa bahay, Lord, in Jesus' name. Father God, touch their hearts right now. Even, Lord, doon sa mga real estate, yung mga may-ari ng mga flats, may-ari ng mga villas, may-ari ng mga buildings, Lord. Touch their hearts right now. In Jesus' name. Use them as our puti paro, God, in Jesus' mighty name. That you would channel blessings, Lord, sa mga tao ito. Hallelujah. For us to be blessed, Lord. Lord, release your favor upon your people, O oh God. In Jesus' name, wag po po hayaan, Lord, na ni isa man sa amin ay maibig, Lord. Ni isa man sa amin ay pagkulang, Lord. Ikaw ang magsupply. Ikaw ang magprovide, Lord, ng aming mga pangailangan, Lord. Release. Lord, don't let there be an open heaven, Lord sa buhay po ng bawat isa. Ipagkalob mo po sa amin na naman ang pangailangan ng bawat isa, Lord. In Jesus' name, I pray, Father God, the, so, doon sa mga grieving families, Lord. Lord, matuloy mo po, Lord, na bigyan sila ng comfort. Palakasin mo po sila. And I pray, Father God, that they would be able to overcome whatever happens to us in the loss of their loved ones. Oh God, may hirap, masakit, Lord, na mawalan ng mahal sa buhay. Pero with your help, oh God, Lord, I pray, Father God, that you would comfort each and every one, oh God, in Jesus' name. You did Iyayakapin mo po ang bawat isa. Pararanas mo, Lord, yung pakaibang pagyakap, Lord. Yung pakaibang presensya mo, Lord, sa buhay po ng bawat isa na nagagigrip ngayon, Lord, na may nalulungkot, na nag-iisa sila, Lord, that He will experience, Lord, yung pagyakap mo. Na, Lord, yung maramdaman nila, Lord, yung presensya mo. 
何も終わらしないと、Right now! ああ、ひっつら、Lord、ええ、なきいさ、Lord、かさかさまかねら、Lord、Jesus、and you are the, you are all, you are always there, oh God. Hindi mo kami iwan, hindi mo kami pababayaan, Lord. You will not forsake us, oh God. Yes. Salamat po, oh Dios. Hallelujah. We are praying even, Lord, sa mga uh, pastors, leaders, sa lahat ng ministry, ng church, oh God, ng body of Christ. We pray, Father God, that you would, Lord, keep the fire in their hearts. Let there be fire in their hearts to serve you more, oh God, even in the midst of all these things. Ay, Lord, patuloy mo ilagay ang apoy sa buhay po ng bawat isa. Hallelujah, let this be, Lord, an opportunity for us to increase our service to you, Lord. Uh, mas magpatuloy kami lalo, lalong-lalo na sa panahon yes. ito, Lord, in Jesus' name. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Lord, let there be an awakening. Lord, let there be a revival of true worship. Of true worship, Lord. In Jesus' name, Lord, patnubayan po kami, gabayan palagi. Let your divine guidance be upon us, O God. Yes. Many are our plans, O God, but your purpose will prevail. Lord, we submit to your will, O God. We submit to your will sa kalooban mo po, Lord. Hindi po namin maintindihan, maraming pagkakataon na hindi namin maintindihan, Lord. Pero nagtitiwala po kami. Katulad ng iyong pangako, Lord, sa Jeremiah 29.11, sabi mo, diniklara mo, you have said this, O God. Sabi mo, Lord, sa iyong salita, for I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord. Plans to prosper you, not to harm you. Plans to give you hope and a future. Ito po yung pangako mo, yung po yung deklarasyon mo po, Lord, sa buhay po ng bawat isa. At patuloy kami kumakapit dito. Ito po ang patuloy namin pinangahawakan at pangahawakan, Lord. Nang pangako mo, Lord, hindi nagbabago. It will come to pass. Mangyayari at magaganap ang iyong mga pangako sa buhay po namin. At sapagkat ikaw ay tapat na Diyos. Hindi ka po sinungaling na Diyos. Ikaw ay tapat. Totoo. Salamat po, O Diyos. Hallelujah. We pray, Father God. Lord, mangyari at maganap ang iyong purpose. Your will be done, O God. Makita namin, Lord. Makita mo rin po kami, Lord, na nang patuloy na naglilingkod sa iyo, tapat na naglilingkod sa iyo, O God. Sa iyo po namin binabalik lahat ng papuri. Pagsamba, pasasalamat, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, everybody says, Amen and Amen. Para pa po sa Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you po mga kapatid sa panonood ngayong gabi at pagsama sa pananangin. I declare blessings upon blessings and favor upon favor po sa buhay po ng bawat isa. Uh, pagpalaan po kayo at uh, ay po ay uh, stay at home po kayo. Yung follow of the government is uh, asking us to do. Ito po ay para po din sa atin. Uh, kung sino man po yung may mga pangangailangan, uh, PM nyo lang po kami. Kaya ang inyong pong church ay, nari, ay uh, ang inyong pong pamilya. Jesus the Night to God Church Budovay is your family. Uh, magtulungan po tayo. Pagtutulungan po namin, po natin yan. Amen po ba? Sige po, God bless everyone. God bless. Good night po.